Nano here, and I have not been offloading lately. Um, but I am gonna make up for it. Um, not with like more uploads, but like I'm just gonna make the sub special happen. Um, you will see it really soon. If not, um, I've up uploaded it already, um, which is probably the case. But if not, then you you should see it soon. Um, uh, but yeah, I I haven't been uploading recently because I've got a really really horrible internet connection, um, and every time I try to upload, it just gives me a uh, it's like a five minute video it will be like four hours or five hours to upload, and even when it does upload, it turns out like corrupted, and doesn't actually work. Um, but in this video. We are going to be looking at a hidden staircase, or like a secret entrance to within this hidden uh, within the staircase. Um, now this is extremely compact. Um, it's as c compact as I can. I could get it. Um, it's four by, I think six by six. Um, so yeah, I think yeah, it's four by six by six. Um, and yeah, I could not, I couldn't get it synced up, um, and still be that small. But you would have to like do some like weird stuff for it because just because of how I wired it and like yeah. But I worked on this for a while actually, um, and yeah, that's how it's turned out, which is I'm pretty pretty proud of. Um, all right, so first off in the tutorial. You want to get yourself two dolphin snake extenders right next to each other with a, another set of normal sticky pistons right there. Um, and then you'll want to get your stairs, which will just go right here and all along there. Um, and then two blocks and then another two blocks. And then that's how wide it's going to be, or that's how that how much in that direction it's going to take up. Um, and then for the the top bit, you want to have a another two pistons right here, with a sticky piston like right there, and then just mirror that on the other side. So just that, that, and then that, and then you want to put your stairs in again. So there and there, and then these. Um, then you want to uh, put your stairs like for the actual um, the staircase in now. So you want to put like something like this just to cover that up. So like that, and then that, and then that, and then that, that, not that, but that, and then that. And then you can do this as well, blah, and then just more blah, and then there. All right. <laughs> um, so what you want to do um, is you want to start off with your input right there, um, and then get something and then you want to get a uh, two blocks down with a resin dot in between them, like that, with a block up right there as well. Um, now I might be a bit rusty on this, um, just because I haven't really made it in a while. <laughs> um, but yeah, so then you want to get your a torch here, and then have a sticky piston right there with a redstone block right there. And then you want to get a, a sticky piston facing up like that. Um, and then get your cauldron like that. Now you can make this one wide as well. You just have to like stop at one side of this um, because this is just like um, like that. <laughs> and so that's pretty cool. Um, so then you want to get a redstone or a comparator like that. Um, but except you want to um, get rid of those blocks actually and then get a dropper hopper sort of thing right here um, like that and that and then you want to get your comparator and then your repeater on there as well and then just put any old item in the dropper um, doesn't have to be anything special um, and then you want to have two blocks right there both with comparators facing in that direction so it will look a little something like that. Um, 
And now, if what you want to do is you just want to get a repeater like down here on two ticks like that. And then if we test that, um, that should do the Dolphus extender. Um, and yes, it does. Awesome. And then all you want to do is for like the this bit right here is you just want to put a block here and then a torch right there and then you can just repeat or like you can just um, redo it if it just does that um, and then if we just test that now um, as you can see it works um, now you can actually just like put blocks right there it won't affect anything um, and plus you don't actually see any redstone like that so that's another bonus um, but the only downside is that it's horribly out of sync, <laughs> um, which is a real pain, but I can't really get, um, do anything about it because of just the way I wired it once again. Um, but yeah, what I'm doing here is I'm just making the same sort of stuff on this side. So just mirrored it. Um, so you just want to put your two dots there and there and then sort of have like a, a circle with a a repeater in the middle of it like that um, and uh, the repeater is on two ticks and then your two comparators right there and there and then your redstone torch and your uh, your piston with a redstone block like that um, now you can replace the this piston or the redstone block there with a null block like that all you got to do is just um, have some way of powering it but Obviously that will go under the build, so I'm just doing a redstone block just for the size. Um, and then you just want to get your uh, your p sticky piston there with a cauldron on top with your water bucket and then just fill it so it's going to output something. Um, and not the block there, but you want to have your... Where's my dropper? There you go. Um, you want to get your dropper hopper falling edge mono stable right there and then get your comparator getting into there and then put your item in your dropper um, and then put a repeater going into a block with a torch on top of that and then you can just reset that as needed um, and then you should be done um, except you want to probably get that so it's kind of seamless, um, except for these two pistons right there, which is probably something that doesn't make it seamless. But if we just cover that up like that, and then we turn it on, as you can see, it works perfectly. And also you just want to, you probably want to have like a stairs up here as well, like that, just so it's completely pimped out. Um, and then there you go. Um, so that's been the, a pretty cool little contraption here. Um, a bit out of sync, but I'll just show you. If, you. if you don't like it out of sync and you want to, like, for the sake of being in sync, um, want to make it in sync, then what you want to do is just have two repeaters here and here, um, like that with dust like that and then another piece of dust like that and then what you want to do is connect these two together so you just want to have like possibly like a torch there and then another torch here and then just a line of dust connecting them um, and then there you go and then just you can power this line right here to make it go or like make it do something <laughs> basically um, and then unpower it for it to turn on so yeah that's been pretty cool and you can even make it um, do that as well so then it's like that which is weird <laughs> but yeah it's gonna fix itself once you actually power it in again so this is basically unslammable, um, but yeah, that's pretty much all I've got for today, for today, um, or, and yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, 
and I hope you guys understand that I couldn't upload recently and and I hope you guys don't really get too upset about it but I doubt you guys are um, since yeah but yeah thank you for watching make comment and subscribe and peace